Okay, um, propeller theory, some more of it. Still talking about basic propeller aerodynamics and the basic theory that we will use to develop the aerodynamic theory is actuated this theory. The actuator disc theory is a mathematical model of the flow through a propeller. Okay, so don't suppose that this actuator disc is actually anything physically realistic. It's not a replacement of a propeller, it's a mathematical model of a propeller. In the mathematical model of the propeller, the important physical effects of the propeller are presented. That is all. Actuator disc theory. So, um, Here's a propeller, and the actuator disc replaces the propeller. We don't talk about propeller blades or anything like that. All we talk about is what the effect of the actuator disc is. So, I'll sketch out the actuator disc. This joining the blackboards makes a convenient point to place the actuator disc. So there's the actuator disc. Okay, now, I mentioned in an earlier clip about the flow through that actuator, through the propeller disc. So the propeller disc is now the actuator disc. So the, all the mass that passes through the propeller disc comes from upstream and travels downstream, forms a stream tube. So this dashed line is the stream tube boundary. Okay. Mass flow rate through that stream tube is M dot. Again, everything for these notes is on the support notes for the course. Um, the thrust, T. Okay, flight speed, V. Okay, now I mentioned that the speed of the air travelling through the disc, propeller disc, is a little bit larger than the flight speed. Also, I'll give myself some. Um, Notation, so one is far upstream, two is at the um, is at the disc, and three is far downstream. So the speed at the disc is V2. The slipstream speed is V3. Far upstream we have pressure P infinity. At the front side of the disc, we've got pressure P2. Low pressure at the front side, sorry, low pressure on the uh, upstream side of the disc, high pressure on the downstream side of the disc. So here we have got pressure P2 plus delta P. Um, that pressure change is due to the blade aerodynamics, so that is included in this mathematical model of the of the uh, propeller. So pressure P2 plus delta P and downstream here the pressure is P infinity. So these are the important uh, things that are presented, accounted for in the actuator disc theory. Um, the velocity V2 is equal to uh, the velocity V plus an inflow, fact, an inflow. So V2 is delta V. Delta V will be the inflow velocity. Um, inflow increment. Okay, so this is what we present for the actuator disc theory, so the rest of it is in the uh, notes for the course. Okay?